If you like to learn on how to make a dairy-free exfoliating cold process soap, then you are at the right place. Hello, I'm Kathy the Clumsy Soaper. Today, I'm going to show you on how to make a simple soy milk and oatmeal homemade soap. I decided to make a batch of soap and thought that I'd like to share my dairy-free alternative for milk. I immediately went to the store and picked up some sugar-free soy milk. As soon as I got home, I saw the oatmeal so I grabbed it and decided to add it in my cold processed soap too. Soy milk soap is perfect for those who have sensitive skin or want something moisturizing on their face or body. While oatmeal soap has oats in it and it will be a mild exfoliator because of the texture. Just imagine the benefits when you combine them together. So get ready and watch this video as I walk you through my whole process. First, let's prepare the lye soy milk solution. Today, I just bought the sugar-free soy milk. Normally, it would take me overnight to soak the soya, then I'll extract the milk the next day. Luckily, soy milk is always available here, so I just bought the commercially available soy milk. Hashtag not sponsored! I placed the container in an ice bath to keep the temperature low. You can also freeze the soy milk, but I prefer this method because it's faster. Once the temperature is below 5 degrees Celsius or 41 degrees Fahrenheit, slowly dissolve the lye into the soy milk. I pour the lye in portions and gently stir it in between. The color will change from off-white color to cream. That is normal. Remember that you need to gear up. Be careful not to burn your hands. I would tell you is that heat will be generated uh, because the reaction is exothermic. You will observe that the temperature will start to increase and build up. It is especially important that your personal protective equipment like gloves, lab gown or apron or long sleeves, and safety glasses when you make soaps at home. Once the lye is fully dissolved, let it stand in an ice bath to cool down the lye soy milk solution. I usually wait until it is around 27 degrees Celsius or 80 degrees Fahrenheit. When you reach this temperature, we are ready to make soap. Pour the lye soy milk solution into the 5 oil blend. This 5 oil blend contains coconut oil, sustainable palm oil, castor oil, olive oil, and jojoba oil. Slowly stir it until you reach an emulsion. Then add the fragrance. Today I decided to use oatmeal, milk, and honey fragrance oil. I stirred it again. And now it's time to add the oatmeal. This is just an instant oatmeal. You can grind it using a meal or you can directly use colloidal oatmeal if you prefer. Once you observe thin to medium trays, you can pour it in the soap mold. While I'm doing this, let me tell you the story about my first soap. 
I'm a young and clumsy girl. I was 13 years old. I had just made some oatmeal soap with my father and it was ready to be put in the mold. It smelled really nice and looked pretty too. When he left, I decided to add more oats into the mixture, almost three folds than what was required. It was an epic fail. The next day, my soap didn't set up. The soap breaks and didn't form well. I was so upset, so my father decided to make soap bowls out of it. I miss my late father so much. Back then, he guided me and supervised me when I was just starting to learn on how to make soap. For the question of the week, tell me something about your first soap. Let me know by writing it down in the comment section below. Let's discuss about the benefits of soy milk. I love drinking soy milk because of the beneficial effects of soy on the skin. Soy protein stimulate the collagen production, delaying the formation of wrinkles or age spots. The vitamin E found in soy protein can combat dryness by restoring moisture to the skin cells. Many people simply achieve more youthful looking complexions by drinking one glass of soy milk per day. The fat, protein, and vitamin contents of soy also adapt to a healthy heart. For oatmeal, it is a healthy food that can be eaten for breakfast, but it also has benefits for your skin. Oatmeal is loaded with beta-glucans, which are great for the skin because they help to heal dry skin and soothe irritated patches of eczema. The fiber in oatmeal helps to keep the digestive system healthy. Oatmeal is a natural cleanser that clears out toxin from the body when used as an enema or bath soak. That is why some people prefer to take oatmeal baths on a regular basis. It has anti-inflammatory properties and finally, oats are rich in vitamin E which protects cells from damage. After two days, I unmolded the soap. Then I cut it with Commando, my multi soap cutter. I planed and beveled the soap and here is the outcome. I produced 5 bars of mildly scented exfoliating soy milk soap. It took me a total of almost 2 hours just to get all this done. From start to finish but it is worth it. Yeah, it smells so good! I hope that you enjoyed our soap making session today. Once again, I'm Kathy, the Clumsy Soaper. This soap making channel is my creative outlet and I've been making soap since 1993. I am a chemist by profession and I work overseas and I'm away from home. So soap making actually helps me to relax and be productive during the weekends. So uh, thank you so much for watching and I'm glad that uh, you're still here listening to me. I'll see you again next week. So remember to hit the subscribe button and give me a thumbs up if you like this video. If not, then give me a thumbs down. That will be fine too. So that at least you can give me a feedback and that's a trigger point for me to improve my content. And give me your feedback also and write down your comments, suggestions in the comment section below. Till next time, bye bye and happy birthday to those who are celebrating their birthdays this month. God bless!